Hi everybody! Today we're going to make bookmarks for the Bible. So I'm using wax paper, hot glue, and some flowers. And these are real flowers. And let's get started by cutting the flower stems. A ton of flowers. Make sure you have a ton of different sizes to make it um, like interesting so it won't be exactly the same. And let me clean it off. And I put a rectangle of hot glue of how big I want the bookmark to be and then add the flowers in while it's still warm. I had to rush through the process, but it looks so cute so far. And I put hot glue all over on top of the flowers and quickly close it with the wax paper and put a heavy book, which the heaviest book I have is the Action Bible. You should totally read that book if you like comics. And peel it off. I peel carefully because just in case if any piece gets on. So as you can see, it's a little bit uneven. So I'm going to put a little extra hot glue to really even it out and put it under the book again. Okay. And now after doing that, I peel it off and now I'm going to cut off all the extra and the flowers will stay fresh in there. So if you want to do something with the flowers you got and you can put flowers that actually have special meaning like these flowers I actually got from my baptism so they actually have a meaningful thing. And I think it's super cute. You could totally add a keychain or something to attach it. And. Okay, I'm going to show you guys how it looks. You can see the comic. And um, it looks so good. It's like not too thick. Because some bookmarks can be too thick and weird. But it's perfect. So I love it so much. And now we're going to get started with the second bookmark. So I have here paint colors, which you can get at Home Depot or Lowe's for free. And I'm just going to cut off all the words. So after cutting that out, I am covering the back with white paper because, as you can see, it has stuff on the back. Which is kind of useless. I used a glue stick and just glued it out. Then, I am going to take a pen and write something. I Here, I am writing a verse which says, Do not fear, for I am with you. Isaiah 41, 10, I think. Yeah, I just forgot. And then I wrote love in the middle one. And the last one, I was very debating which verse to do. As you can see, I'm thinking. Okay, I finally picked the verse. And it says, with God, all things are possible. Which is Mark, 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 ten twenty seven. Yeah, I just forgot, but I cut it out. I did it in the paper still because just in case if I got it off the edge. And as you can see, it like spread it a little bit. So I'm. Uh, I repeated it on the other one, spreading it on purpose and just rewriting it because that was a mistake that was made. And what? what? Well, I rewrote Isaiah, Mark, and I love writing the cursive love, so... 
There we have two bookmarks ideas for your Bible. For any book, I recommend using Sharpie, not a pen.